everybody. So today going to be a little different. Uh, I wanted to talk about something that just happened uh, between a couple days ago and this morning. So first I wanted to get out of the way that it's important to me that I know okay it's not important important but I like to know who is still around from the golden age of Hollywood and there are a few people out there and some even have social media which I've tried contacting and nothing's ever come up but you know maybe they're just too busy or whatever so this was part of a project that I wanted to do so it's like if I do if I go out to an old Hollywood actor or whatever and they come back to me then it's kind of like oh yay response I'm gonna make a video all that stuff so there there's been two that I've done this recently one by letter one by social media and the social media message is what we're tackling today I got a response from none other than Olivia de Havilland I forget how I found out that she was on social media but I think I just looked her up and I was like oh okay and you got to be careful on social media of course because some people will just use the name and just think it's them so I looked over the bio and everything that's on the bio is what she you know like where she actually was born and all that stuff and in her description she's like happily retired and I thought okay this could be her so I went ahead and sent a little message and I will read to you what I said I wrote dear Misty Haviland I am a huge fan of your work on Gone with the Wind as well as your work with Errol Flynn of course they were cute together do you enjoy seeing people's reactions to your films who was your favorite acting partner do you have a favorite movie you worked on and then I say, thank you so much for your talent and giving your fans a great many movies. God bless. This was written Thursday at 2.07 p.m. Okay, so this was Thursday. Today is Monday. So, you might as well say it was Monday morning because this was written at 2.19 a.m. She wrote back and said, dear Courtney, Thank you very much for your kind letter and asking about my work. I am glad you enjoy and are a fan. I very much do enjoy the reactions I get from people who watched my movies and enjoyed them. I loved working with Errol Flynn. I had a huge crush on him back in the day. Also, I loved working with Betty Davis, whom was a dear friend of mine. My favorite movie, hmm, that is a tricky question. I so loved working on Gone with the Wind and also The Heiress. Hope that in, hope that answers your questions. I wish you the best. Blessings. If that is legit, Olivia de Havilland, you can imagine my thrill when I got that message. I was so ecstatic. I have so many more questions to ask her, but I don't want to come up as a stalker. So I don't want to just keep hammering her. So I'm trying to take a step back, but I have her messages saved. So I can always go back and reply back to those later on. Which I've already replied. I just said thank you for responding. I really appreciate it. But still, that meant so much to me. I do. I love her in Gone with the Wind. I love her in The Adventures of Robin Hood. I liked her in many other Errol Flynn projects she's she was she was a great talent uh like i said there's so many more questions i want to ask her but again i want to just take a step back and just not get too you know stalkerish so that was it for this first installment of i reached out to this actor something like that uh, so I hope you've enjoyed this video have you written to an old Hollywood star and have you ever met them and what were they like and what were your feelings about it let me know in the comments below and I will see you all in my next video bye have a great wonderful day